Hello, friends and neighbors. Welcome to another production of the program. Here we are on TV once again, once a day, every day. Turn on the machines and live forever. Here we go. I'm a live man all the way back around here to uh, Tuesday. Who would have thought I would have made it this far? Call that number up there, 360-836-384, or go to whitehwm.com. That's what I'm doing. I sometimes do it before we start, but now I'm doing it. After we start, when, after, before, after. Uh-oh. YouTube is already questionable. Unquestionable. Uh, yeah, Tuesday, who would have thought? Who would have thought? Watch this. Ding, 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 ding. Da, ding, ding. Yep, here I am, on the couch, living life, eating food, being a regular person. I know Mark wants to be a regular person. I got uh, something different today. They think what uh, they give me like a couple of couple of pieces of broccoli. Thank you. What about chicken? Is there chicken in here? Yeah, I should stick with what I I get, get all the time. I got uh the the pad thai today. Usually I get some different kind of food, like whatever they got, but today I got pad thai. And from Far East, usually I get the, the lunch special. But today, Pad Thai. Yesterday, I was here on Monday at around, what? Right time? Mmm. Very good. It's a really good taste. Um, well, yesterday, Monday, around 8.45, talking to James and Heather uh, about but butlery. Butlery. Maybe other things, too, but lovely butlery, if I remember. Um, after the program, Freddie came here and gave me a ride to a person at his house, and then to my house over there in Lacey. But, uh, first, yeah, Freddie was driving me around even though he didn't come on the program after doing anything like that. We are playing, he was playing some game at that house, other people. Who knows what's like uh like as far as like virus times, what's right and wrong? Hard to know. So I'm gonna buy some fish sauce. Fish sauce is a cheaper ingredient to the food. I'm making myself. Um I, uh, yeah, went, went to Freddy's, talking to friend, some, some friends over there. There's a dog there. What a nice dog. I kind of want to get a dog. I'm on the edge of getting a dog. I'm thinking about it. After, um, after Freddy gave me a ride to Lacey, we, uh, I prepared for this job interview today. I had a job interview I just did. So last night I was like looking through for uh, looking for job clothes. 
So I was like, where's my job clothes? Is it, uh, gra where's Grandpa's job clothes? I thought maybe Grandpa would have job clothes, but he had, um, big, <laughs> he only had big 70s clothes. I'm gonna go to the job just like I'm from the 70s, like actually vintage 70s clothes from the old man. But I'm set up on this shirt. If you notice what I'm wearing, weird shirt. Cause this shirt is my job shirt. I think it's actually the same shirt I wore when I got a job. Um. So I woke up early this morning after making the resume. And then I went to uh, the um, uh, I went to the coffee shop where my brother gave me a ride. I left my bike here downtown last night, which was stupid, but maybe it worked out because otherwise I might have been late. But I put my bike. I didn't put my bike in Freddie's car last night, which I probably should have done. Maybe I should do that today. But I don't know what he's doing tomorrow. What my Andrew's doing tomorrow. But I'm doing a program earlier tomorrow, I think. But today, I uh, my brother gave me a ride to the the bus station. Oh, Jesus! And then I rode the bus down here, and then I went to. Uh, Olympia copy and print and I printed out some resumes to go get a job. So I'm going to this uh male sorting facility. And I don't know, I guess it's secret. The government, government secret. So I'm going to be holding on to government secrets and I can't tell anybody. But can you tell somebody that it's a secret? <coughs> like, is that where it is a secret? If you tell somebody the secret? I don't know. Oh, hey, Freddy's here. I thought you were going to be here at 1.30. It's only 1 o'clock. What are you looking at over there? Plant? Oh, the camera. <laughs> I was like, what are, you, what are you doing? What's wrong? What's going on over there? Yeah, what's on the thing? Is it Look uh, behind you. Whoa, whoa, what is that? The couch? That's the couch. That's. I destroyed that couch. <laughs> <laughs> I thought I killed you. <laughs> uh, yeah, I, got a, I found this couch on the street just five minutes ago. Yeah, what are you going to do with it? I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> yeah. It's a hide bed Ew. Is it gross? I don't. I don't know. Should I put it back where it was? <laughs> where, where, where was it? Outside of pizza time. Yeah. I asked the pizza time people, "Let's deal with the couch," and they said, "Someone who lives upstairs just put it down there. It's free." So well, I took it. I think it's a little gross, but yeah, it seems a little gross. What do you? What do you? What do you do with it? I'm not sure. I don't know. It's uh, I need a couch for my room and oh, my you, house. You do? But maybe it's gross. Does it? Did you smell it? No, I didn't smell it. <laughs> well, could be gross. I mean, if it's uh, the worst thing that happened, you could just put it back where you found it in the alley. Yeah, I think. <laughs> Where'd you find it? You in the alley say, downtown. If you say, oh, maybe you should put it back. I'm gonna, I'm gonna show it to Madeline. She's really probably gonna say <laughs> it's gross. Well. It's hard to know with virus know. time. Yeah, that's true. That's true. You're not gonna catch the virus from a couch, though. Oh probably. yeah. All right. Um, I'm yeah. gonna I'm gonna go get. I actually have an order at Far East, so I'm gonna go. Oh get wow. Far East. What did you eat there? Far East. Oh yeah. Nice. All right. I'm gonna go I'll to Far Come back. I'll be back. Why don't you take take your mic with you? Try to say something when you come back. See if that works. Okay. I got you walking up. That'll be fun. I'll try to say something. Look, I'll be like, whoa, what's going on? You're going to say to me, why do you have a microphone? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> why are you holding a microphone? Yep. Well, are you going to walk there? Yeah, I'm going to walk there. Oh, yeah. Put the microphone 
in your pocket, I guess. <laughs> yeah. Well, you can say stuff when you're walking back. And I can say stuff as I go down the stairs, too, probably. That way, you know, even no matter what you're talking about or who you're talking to, butt in and I can't hear what's going on. If I, and on the, I could watch on the YouTube. I, got, I might be able to, I'm going to try something. When I come back, when I come back, I'll try it. Um, yeah, I did this job interview, and uh, I don't know, I think it's a secret. So, if I get this government job, not like I really talk about my work anyway, I'm going to be in the secrets, in, in with the secrets. But maybe it's a secret, is it, are secret, secrets or secrets in self? You don't want to say, hey, I got a secret. Once you tell somebody that you have a secret, then the secret is out. But uh, I don't have a secret yet, but I might soon if I get this job. We'll see what happens with it. It's going to be a different time. Um, I got to get a car. I'm not going to be working from home if I do actually get this one. After work, I, uh, I mean, not after work, after the, I guess it's kind of work. I came down here to the studio again. And then I decided I wanted to get lunch. So I, well, I'm, like, I'm going to go get Thai truck. I decided. And I went over to the Thai truck. And they were closed on Tuesdays. I want a pad thai. I decided I want a pad thai. I had pad thai a few days ago. It was good. And I remembered it. And I was like, oh, no pad thai. Huh? Maybe I'm going to go get my regular thing at Far East. And then I, I, I thought, hey, maybe I'll go to that new place over there. That uh, new Thai place. Closed on Tuesdays also. Because Tuesday is a slow day for food. They were closed. Thai truck was closed. I ended up coming back here because I had to call somebody. I didn't want other places I didn't want to not call them. So I was going to call. I was either going to call. There's like so much Pad Thai downtown. Thai truck, Narai, Thai Pavilion, the new place, and Far East, and Mekong. How many is that? They all make Pad Thai. But I decided to go try Far, Far East Pad Thai. It's okay, but I think I would prefer the just regular meal that I get normally. And it's actually about half the price, so I'm going to get to go. Next time I'm going to get the regular Far East meal. And maybe not the Pad Thai, but I got the, the Pad Thai from them. It's pretty good. And uh, I made it back here. The other places were not open. So what time is that about? And then I came here. Now I'm here. And I'm alive, Freddy's alive, he's gonna come back here. Maybe we should get over there on the messages before Freddy comes back and see who's there on the messages. Well, Freddy wanted to listen to the messages too, but I'm waiting for him to say something on the uh, uh, mic. Da 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 <laughs> Freddy's couch. All right, let's check out the uh, the messages. Freddy, you watching on YouTube? Oh. I got a problem because that guy's gonna be calling. I think the number on the program instead of uh, my personal number would have would have been better, but I I accidentally gave this those people the program number so now we gotta check these messages we gotta check for the, the program messages at the same time maybe i gave them a better phone number i don't know i don't remember filling out the stuff oh it looks like mark the guitar player left some messages mark what you got to say today Oh man, I ate all my pills last night. Now it's the daytime. Is it too late? 
Oh. Or is it too early? I mean, I'm like combining these pills, like, like, it's only been, I mean, it's been like over 12 hours, but uh, it hasn't been 24 hours. <laughs> oh yeah, Mark? Oh wow. Yeah, I'm having a lot of trouble with a lot of bullshit going on. This is Mark from Rebecca. We're having, I'm having a lot of trouble and it's blowing up inside and I gotta deal with it. Stop being a wacky character, you know. I gotta mellow out and try to enjoy life. I have nothing against other races. Other people. Why are you talking I mean, about they're all God bless people. You got to take care of them. They be nice to them. And try to enjoy life. Try to get along with people. It's not easy sometimes, you know. It's frustrating I'm trying to get some guys off alcohol. Trying to get them with dr off drugs, you know. It's not working too well. I try to deal with people. It gets all wacky and stuff, you know. Kenny, you're a good, you're a good person, you know. And, and Freddie's a good person. I know that for sure. You're both good people. And I'm sorry if I ever offended you. And, you know, this is really on my mind. And I don't know. Trying to get off cigarettes, it's not working very well. And I don't want to be a hypocrite and say I'm not, and I'm not, not smoking and smoke anyway, you know. Is that a hypocrite? It's hard because I started when I was nine, smoking cigarettes. Yeah, all that nicotine withdrawal is horrible. Well, I gotta, I gotta face my problems and deal with it. Maybe I'll get, maybe I'll get better. I hope. Trying to be a good person, you know. It's not easy sometimes. But you guys, I tell you, you guys have a God blessed day. I hope your day goes good, both of you, everybody around you. Have a God blessed day. I hope you're okay. All right. God bless all our farm. Hello, program. I got missed. And I miss you. I got brother? been calling or listening. I am sorry. Whoops. Um, summertime, you know. Busy and great. Uh, oh. and I just come have Kenny, fun. can you hear me? Yep. Swimming, you know. I can hear you. Can you hear me okay? I can hear you. Hello? Yes. You can't hear me. You can't hear me. I can hear you. Maybe you, are you watching on YouTube? I can hear you. Oh, you can? Where? How? What? I'm watching on YouTube, but there's a really big delay. Oh, there you are, outside on your truck, right? Yeah. I'm outside right now. I can hear you. How's, I mean, I don't even want to smell the couch. Uh, should I sit on it? Should I smell it? I don't know. I don't, I wouldn't want to smell it. I'm going to smell it. Yeah. It smells fine. <laughs> it doesn't smell bad. It doesn't smell like pizza. There's still sheets on the bed, so at least they're using sheets on the bed. Yeah. I kind of want to do, just like, get one of those couches. You kind of want what? So you get a couch, and then you open it up, and then you just put, like, a mattress on it. Yeah. And then I was thinking about just getting rid of the mattress and putting a new mattress on the inside. I don't know what kind of mattress you need, though for this kind of a bed. Yeah, but what if you just put like a regular mattress on there and then it, that's your bed? I can't hear you anymore. Oh, okay. Well, when but I'm walking up the stairs. But the stairs, I guess we'll call Jean. Um, I don't want to see Jean's in the yep. thing. Two months ago, Jean, when was the last time I talked to you? Well, that was pretty good. 
So, I'm calling G. If you like, get the um, get the remove the mattress, and then you put a new mattress on there. Yes. And then that's just your bed. Uh huh. And then your bed is a couch. Yeah. And then you have like a really good be- he- like headboard. Oh yeah, that is a nice headboard. I guess you have a really b- bad bed. Yeah. But if it if it's good, it's like a couch headboard. I don't know why they don't make headboards like that with like with built-in. Cushion. Your call has been forwarded to an automated uh, voice oh, messaging system. Two, zero, Uh-oh. six, Gee, three, no. five. Gotta get four, a new five. voice message. Is not available. Woo. At the tone, please record your message. You mark when messages? you finished recording, you may hang up or uh, press one for bit. more options. He's trying to be a good person. Hey, Jim, it's the program. You can call us back. Let's send this to my message, though. Hey, Gene, call us back. Good to hear from you. I miss you. Gene said, I miss you. Uh, miss you too, Gene. Did, uh, did Rebecca leave a message too? Nope. No? Mark that was Gene. I was, it was Gene. I was walking around. You know, on the Bye, Gene. on the internet, it has a really loud hiss. Like a really Ooh. high-pitched, like... Is that constant? Yep, all the way, all the way constant. Why? I don't know. I wonder if it's the mixing board we've been using. Well, I don't know. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I'm not really monitoring that too well. I don't think it's really too big of a deal, but it's there. All right. Actually, I can kind of hear it here, too. You hear that? It's like his. Yeah, I do. Maybe. I mean, probably this this mixing board. This is like the crappy mixer. mixer. Yeah. The better one is here somewhere. It is. Yeah. Which is I'm gonna call. This this uh, setup is extra organic these days. Yeah. It's really kind of grown in weird ways that I don't remember. I got green bean chicken. Hmm. Trying to work my way through their menu. That's one of my mainstays. Hey, Mark. Hey, how's it going? Hey, good, how are you? Oh, pretty good. I'm sitting here having cheese its You like cheese its Fucking fuck! <laughs> I do like cheese its Mark. Yeah, pretty good, I thought. So, you say bacon on it, but I didn't taste no bacon or nothing. Bake, there's bacon in the cheese its Well, it's bacon flavor or whatever. I don't taste no, I don't taste no bacon. Weird, like artificial bacon flavor always reminds me of dog treat. Yeah. Or, like bacon, bacon uh-huh. strips. Do you have bacon strips? Well, their, their cheese is supposed to have bacon flavor on them. But you know, like, reason. you know, like, it's bacon! You know what I'm talking yeah, about? Yeah, it's bacon! <laughs> you know that commercial? Huh? You know that commercial? Yeah, it's kind of funny, huh? Yeah, it's got the dog. Yeah. You know, have you seen that, Freddie? Yeah. Probably not. Nope. Uh, the dog. Weird the dog thinks it's bacon, but it's not bacon. I don't even know what it is. Yeah. What is that stuff? <laughs> That's kind of a weird commercial, huh? Whatever it is, it's not bacon. It's like the the dog. Yeah. The dog thinks it's bacon. It's well, not. No, it's, a it's not bacon. It's I don't know what it is. Is it dog food or what? It's dog treats. It's probably a flavoring or something. It's dog treats, and the whole thing is that it's not bacon. The yeah, dog thinks yeah. it's bacon. Dogs are way smarter than we are in terms of taste and smell. They know exactly what yeah. it is. How are you doing? How are you doing, Freddie? Oh, I'm doing pretty good. I oh, just, that's I, good. I work yeah. an opening shift. Hey, we got one million more shots done. We got to wait a week now. Yeah. You got what? Oh, you got. You it's just a little pin prick in the arm. That's about it. You, you know? got the vaccine. Nice. Good work, Mark. Yeah. You gotta. You gotta that's get. That's just a little pin prick, and we're we're all right. We got our card to show them when in a week to do it. Yeah, that's know? good. You were more important now than ever. Yeah, it's, a, it's very important. It's a safety fa- factor, you know. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, you gotta make sure you're safe. Okay. And other people too, you know. Hey, Mark, listen to this. Okay. Yeah. Playing this. I dang it, fucking fuck! Do <laughs> <laughs> you remember that? Yeah, yeah. That was pretty good. <laughs> well, 
it's like Remy at home alone, you know, like, to, to pass me. Yeah. Um. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what were we saying though? We're saying something. Oh, vaccines. That's good, Mark. Hey, uh, today looks pretty good out there. It's, it's kind of not nice weather, you know. Oh, really nice. I've really been enjoying the weather the past week. I think a lot of people are going to go to the beach probably, huh? Well, it's not that hot. Oh, well, just today, I mean, maybe, for, maybe for a walk or something. Huh? It's pretty much perfect weather out there. Maybe for a walk or something. I probably should ask that guy. Yeah. More questions. I, I I had the oh, an interview. I had a job interview. That's why I'm wearing my my job clothes. Oh. oh, oh. Is that your uh, grandfather's shirt? This is actually my shirt. All my grandfather's shirts look really really 70s. <laughs> <laughs> like I'm here for this interview from the 70s. Yeah. I was hey, talking to my brother hey, about. Hey, 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 Kenny. Yes. I haven't had a cigarette in four days. Isn't that cool? That is cool, Mark. That's really cool. And instead of having a cigarette, I have like a sandwich or something, you know? <laughs> yeah, that's a lot of sandwiches. You put another hot weight? dog or something. Remember, you know? like, it used to be like cigarettes were advertised as like a cool guy thing. Like, but hey, look at me. Like, now it's like I have maybe sandwiches. A hot dog or chips or something, you know? Yeah. Whoa, look at that guy. He's popcorn eating a hot dog and some chips over there. Damn. Yeah, popcorn's, got, popcorn's always good. <laughs> Caramel popcorn, you like that? I Caramel? like popcorn. Yeah, that's all yeah. right. You know, why not? And instead of having a cigarette, I have caramel popcorn. Isn't that pretty cool? I like that's, that. That's cool, Mark. Cool, yeah. Daddy O. I'm, hey, hey, Kenny, I'm trying to better myself. You know, make myself better. And my doctor actually says I could probably eventually go out and get me a car, get a license for the car. You know. Mm-hmm. Hey, Doc. You think I'll ever drive again? Huh? He said, hey, Doc, do you think I'll ever drive a car again? Well, I talked to the doctor. The doctor thinks that I'm off my meds to a certain degree. I'm not to where I could get a license and get a car, you know. Wow, where, where do you want to go? I'm driving a car to you. Where, where would you bus. go? I could go visit you in, a, in my own car instead Whoa. of taking a bus, you know. Hmm. This is just a long way yeah, out. Yeah, you can, know? especially if you get the vaccine. And if you don't call me that name. It's, it'll be a while before I get a car, but I mean, I could do the process and it just takes That's time good. to you think you can drive? take the test, be honest, and take the test. And, and I don't know how much to talk about these job interviews, but I'm going to talk a little bit about it. They had, they showed me, like, part of the job that I'm trying to get right now, or this job, I guess, that is, like, they're like, they're like, you want to drive? I heard oh, you. They're like, they're like, this, part of this job might be driving uh, this big truck. Would you want to yeah, drive the big cool. truck? Cool, I said, Kenny. yes. <laughs> right. I don't know if I do. <laughs> like, uh, I'm like, oh, not really. <laughs> Yes, I do. You're like, gonna, oh, man, giving a job interview right. to someone who's trained right now, I'm trying to reach in my pocket for a guitar pick. I don't know where that damn guitar pick went. I like playing guitar once in a while, you know. Trained yeah. as a what? Yeah. You're like, like an improv. You're like, <laughs> oh, yeah. You've been doing out. some improv just, acting with Dan Dobler. I just I to yeah. pick things, you know. I don't really sing or nothing. I just pick things out on my guitar and kind of mellow out. You, know. you say yes and. Yeah, but you can't say no. I mean, how would you say no to anything? Would you like to drive the big truck? Yes. Yeah. And I can fix it too. <laughs> oh, why did I say that? No. Oh. Yeah. Hey, Kenny. Yes. Do you? <laughs> just to be picking it, there's a plant. One more time? Instead of doing a whole song, you just pick around on it. Do I ever pick around the guitar instead of playing a whole song? Just play, pluck the guitar. I do. I actually sound. do pluck in way more than a full song. Well, I mean, sometimes you don't do a song, you just play it just to jam out or something, just to That's practice right. or something. I actually almost never play the whole song. Most songs are pretty repetitive to me. If I'm sitting at home, yeah, yeah. If I'm sitting at home, I'm plucking around. I'm playing. I just call it dinking around. I just call it dinking around the guitar. You know, I call it dinking around the guitar. I call it plucking. Yeah, without get without the, doing get, get a the song. Yeah, I, I like to um, watch TV uh, 
Uh, while I watch TV, I play a video game, and then if there's like a commercial and a cutscene at the same time, I'm playing the guitar yeah. a little bit, you know? Sometimes I'm yeah. playing guitar, but it's all, I'm doing all that all at once. I play a lot of the guitar, I just sit there uh, next to the chair where you watch TV. Yeah. And then I just play the guitar while I'm watching TV. Hey, you know what else I've been doing? What? I'll say to get me a, hey, are you there, Kenny? Oh, yeah, I'm still I'm, here. Oh, yeah. Hey, Kenny? Yeah, 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 I'm here. I was just thinking about buying a acoustic guitar and setting a little ways from the pool, enough to where I don't get my guitar wet, acoustic guitar wet, and just picking in the guitar without the singing. Pool? Maybe the people that are swimming that like to hear the picking around, you know. You're going to perform for swimmers? I don't know, over at the pool here. At this hey, oh, at the apartment? Yeah. Apartment clock, right here Mark, at the apartment clock. Think, like they have a pool. Do you think they make a guitar that uh, could play underwater? No, no, just, uh, they have chairs out there and stuff. You can sit in a chair and play the guitar where people swim. Yeah, chairs are a good place to play guitar. Huh? Chairs are a good place to play guitar. Especially acoustic guitar. Yeah, yeah. Well, see... Yeah, this one, I think you sit down when you're playing acoustic guitar. Uh, Kenny, they could be swimming or something, and I could just be away from them at, at the pool in a chair somewhere. They're swimming? And just play, picking you on the guitar. You, know? you, you are... They could enjoy, enjoy my picking. You know, hey, I that's don't a really nice, sing much. That's a nice picking, they could say. Yeah, I, I don't really uh, sing much, you know. I just play the guitar. Just they, around on it, you know? maybe, yeah. maybe somebody do a couple of laps, they'll come out and they'll say, hey, it's a nice picking. No, they um, could uh, get out of the pool and come up to me and say, hey, that sounded pretty good. Hey, good pick. That's a good picking. Um, you ever swim? No, I don't swim much. I have a hard time swimming. All I know is the doggy paddle. Yeah. You didn't try the butterfly? Or the... Dolph? Dolphin? Is that a, what's, what do they do? What do you, uh, what, there's a breaststroke? I don't know that stuff. There's like I a, just know the doggy paddle, that's you all. You know what I think, the butterfly? Yeah. It's like a really weird way to swim. Oh. Uh, but it's a whole race. I don't know all that stuff. All I know is just the doggy paddle. And yeah. Comfortable. But the, with the butterfly, it's like you have to swim in a really weird way. And yeah, that would be right. like if it was like when yeah. running, it's like hop yeah, on one foot. Uh, swimming, so like, hey, this is a hop on one foot race. Yeah. I don't, and, like, I don't swim be, much, like, Kenny, because it's like. Instead of running like this, you have to run like this. Like, clap like, your arms like a chicken. Like chicken. <laughs> chicken running, and it's like you have to have your form. Kenny, I'm uncomfortable with swimming, so I don't swim much, you know. That's it's uncomfortable for me. Is is it impossible to have an underwater guitar? Is it just like because I, I don't the, know. The I'm not talking about underwater. I'm just talking up on the top, you know, around the pool. We're thinking about the a guitar, dink around on it. We're well, changing the subject a little bit. Like we're altering the subject. I'm playing, you know. You're talking about guitars next to the pool, and we're moving on in our minds. The guitars in the pool. It's just logic. It just makes sense. That'd be good. Steps, taking steps, you know. I've heard that. Well, I make sure that they don't get my guitar wet, you know. Yeah, I feel like. Yeah, I mean, there's a couple things. I've heard acoustics travel pretty well underwater, somehow. Like that's why whales can send their uh, sounds so far, and they can uh -huh. talk to each other yeah. underwater. But I think maybe part of the whole guitar thing is it needs air. I don't know if it could do it. Underwater. Oh, I kind of, I kind of see what you're saying. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Yeah, pretty cool. Yeah. Have you ever tried to yell underwater? I don't think uh -huh. I have. have you, like, it sounds like. You like? Maybe, maybe is that like a game? You like in a, a pool? I wonder, game? If, I wonder if you could actually have a, a speaker built that's able to go under the water. Yeah. And you listen to music underwater. Wouldn't that be weird? That would be weird. I don't know why they're doing that. There are Bluetooth speakers that are that can get dropped in the water. A plastic speakers or something. But they're not made to like stay down there, or are they? I don't know. Yeah, that'd be weird. Hearing music underwater. Wouldn't that be strange? Yeah. yeah. I feel like I played a game that's like a kids game where you go under the water, and try to talk yeah, to each that's other. Cool. Hey, can you hear me? I can hear you. <laughs>
Well, if you give it a try, you can let us know how it goes, I guess. Playing music to yeah. people in the pool. Yeah, yeah. I'm always, I'm always wondering about, you know, like... I got to I gotta put new strings on my guitar. I popped a string, so I have to put new strings on it today. What string? Ah, uh, the E string. I don't know. I gotta put the E. I gotta put a brand new E string on there because I uh, popped it accidentally. Hi E O L O E. Huh? Hi E O L O E. Oh hi E. Yeah hi E. Hi E O L O E. Hi E. Hi E. Hi E. Hi E. Hi E. Hi E is low. I mean uh. That's thin. funny. That's funny. Hi E. Hi E. Hi E. Hi E. Hi E is thin. Hi E. Hi E. Hi E. Hi E O L O E. That's funny. That's kind of funny. Ay, 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 ay. Yeah. <laughs> you want to drive a car, Mark? Well, I've dri driven my dad's car out in the field, but I never did drive it on the streets. Like in the grass? I, well, we were out in the field driving out in the field. Grass? We didn't, I didn't drive it on the streets. Was it grass? No. Huh? Was it made out of grass? Yeah, out in the grass or whatever, yeah. Sometimes when I'm riding my bike, I think about how dependent the bike is on the roads. Yeah, I see tricks, and I can never do that stuff. I don't know why. What Our tricks? Skateboards, you know? Oh. Skateboard tricks. I don't know how to do that stuff. To fix some kind of... Not too late. I sprained my ankle trying to do a skateboard one time. That was weird. In, like... The 80s, though, right? Yeah, probably in the 80s, 81, 82 or something. How's your ankle now? I don't know. I don't know how to do a skateboard very well. But how's your ankle? No, oh, it's fine. It was just this little sprain or something. Uh, how about your uh, How about your hips? How's your hips? Oh, that's great because I worked with that. I did sit-ups and I kind of walked around a lot in the, in the apartment until I got it. Finally went downstairs, be able to walk downstairs. Went to the doctor's office and they said, Mark, you're fine, <laughs> whatever. That's great. Yeah. That Are you still cool. exercising? Yeah. Very easily. You work with your muscle, try to get your muscle in back into place and stuff. You're okay. You gotta keep doing that exercise. Yeah, yeah, that's true. Uh, how's uh, Rebecca? Oh, she's doing good. She's in there doing artwork. I don't want to bother her right now because she told me not to bother her because. That's a good reason. Artwork, 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 drawing pictures and stuff. You want to bother her? Cause she's not to bother her. She's really getting good. I'd like to actually have her do one of my album covers. That'd be cool. Yeah, that's a great collaboration yeah. idea. Maybe, maybe her doing art, uh, art project on my album cover or something. You know. What's it's your, only personal copies, you know, I'm not professional or nothing. What's your next album going to be called? Oh, I don't know. I have to think of that one out. Oh. I was trying to think that one out yesterday, but I can't figure something you, yet. Are you still playing under Split Horizons? Oh, yeah, trying to figure that out, you know, yeah. how what, it works. What was your last album called? Uh, my last album was called K Still Kicking, which means you're still jamming and stuff. Still yeah. Kicking, that's yeah. a good name. To still kicking, it's called. Yeah, that's good. That means Mark's, you're still jamming, still playing guitar. Mark's uh, Mark's songs are on yeah. some of the episodes. The um, right. It's what gonna they, be on tonight. Tonight. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Today, Tuesdays with uh, Split Horizons, you're doing the theme music on the show. Oh wow! Isn't that something? Yeah. Yeah, that's, that's neat. I like that. On Tuesday, that's yeah. Cool. You want to yeah. hear a message from Yellowfell? Sure. Sure. Yeah, go ahead. Hey, uh, so I need to get a oil change in my car. Um, aren't you thinking about doing a car? Yeah, oil changing? You should. Okay, you can you? you get? Yeah. Is, uh, is your car involved in some of your, uh, 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 studio stuff? What? Is he involved is, in some of our studio yeah, is, stuff? Is Joe Fell uh, involved in some of your studio stuff, your recordings and stuff? No. I don't think... I don't, uh, just a, this is a question I had. I was kind of curious about it. Joe yeah. Fell lives in uh, Philadelphia. Oh, wow. Hi. You ever been to Philadelphia? Uh, no, I haven't. I haven't. 
Bye, future. Yellow fella was getting an oil change, which is something you got to do when you have a car. It's like the worst part about having a car is the maintenance. You ever think about that, Mark? You're gonna get, what kind of car are you going to get, Mark? What, what are you thinking? Well, I don't know. I'd like to get something. Well, I actually get something dependable where I don't have to be under the hood all the time. Yeah. And it has to be reliable, and I have to have a car that's basic. It has to be cheap because I can't afford stuff, really. Ah. You know, it has to be cheaper type of stuff, you know. You know, like, you want, like, a... Uh, like a I like wagon? a small little truck. That'd be or cool because I get all my equipment and stuff. Oh, that's a good idea. <clears throat> That'd be kind of cool. Small little truck, you know. And they want to buy the Nissan Leaf. I'm I'm leaning towards it. How much, how much do you pay for gas? Like a month? Uh, probably over hundred fifty dollars or something. Cause it's about sixty dollars to fill up the tank. Yeah. Oh. Uh. I get that leaf. I mean, but then you got to pay for electricity. Yeah, you know, gas takes a lot of money, so you're gonna have to have gas. You gotta have insurance. You gotta have tabs, all that stuff. Yeah, I think the gas costs more than anything, really, when you add it up. Yeah, it's just repetitive. It's just over and over. You the know? leaf is the same. Like, the payments on it would be like that much, probably. Hey, what kind of car did you have, Kenny, at one time? My last car was a Toyota Corolla. Hey, those are pretty dependable, huh? Nope. Not that one. No? You really not? It was really, uh, well... Undependable. It was dependable on breaking down. <laughs> oh, boy. Yeah. That's nuts. <laughs> yeah. That's a bummer. <laughs> I, I want to get me a nice truck, little small truck that'll do the job and not have to worry about fixing it all the time, you know? Yeah. Sounds like a dream car. I always yeah, it's a, it's it's a a way, Mark, yeah, I, right. en I envied your life of of uh, doing nothing, no car, no phone. Yeah, you know. Doing doing nothing means a lot to me. How about that? <laughs> yeah, good. All right, let's listen to this message, and then we'll record messages in the future. Uh, Can't really understand him. Uh, I wonder if his mouth's feeling better. Right now I'm playing with toothpaste. Oh, <laughs> nope. And my teeth. Yellow Fellow so, got a toothache. You feel the same. And. There we go. Ah, is it hard to understand? Yeah, it's actually. Hey, Kenny. Yes. Kenny. Yes. You like watermelon? <laughs> you like watermelon? Um, yes. That's pretty good, huh? You get those chunks sometimes instead of a, water, a big watermelon. You get like a thing full of chunks and stuff. Uh, right. Yeah, I don't like to get the pre-cut stuff. I want to get the whole thing. I, I think the pre-cut stuff, I don't know. It's already sliced for, you know. I don't know where it is. It's kind of like... It's like Safeway's got them. They're already sliced for you. You know, know. like ground beef or something. You want it's like cheaper mm -hmm. because it's cut up and you don't know what's in there. But with watermelon, yeah. it costs more when it's cut up. But you can get like a steak. Um, like a whole watermelon's like yeah. a steak of watermelon. You, of, you don't even yeah. have all these yeah. chunks they, are from the same they watermelon. Watermelon is already yeah. sliced up for you, little chunks. I want to do my own slicing. Oh uh, yeah, that's true. I don't trust those slicers. I want it's to good. I want it's to chew it back to the way. rind. I like that part. Chewing where, it back to the yeah. Rind. Yeah. where and when are they slicing that stuff? Like, yeah, you like to have it the way you want it, you know? Yeah, I want to slice it my own yeah. way. Like, when when and where did they slice the watermelon? It's like, I don't know when, when and where. Yeah, I actually, yeah. You like to have it the way you want to slice it and stuff, you know? I pretty much have never bought a parking meter guy across the street. I don't know if I can, can you see him. Yeah. Oh, yeah, there he is. Yeah, how's your parking? Oh, bastard. How's um, you, you okay? I think my parking's pretty good. I saw some well, photos on the street. Kenny, I Kenny, I gotta get going because I gotta go out to the mailbox and get my mail now. Okay, okay bye, Mark. Oh. Bye bye now. You gonna be okay? I can't really tell. Maybe you wanna go? I'm yell or? at him if he uh, tries to get me in. Yeah, yeah, there's like a quarter. I saw a bunch of quarters on the street, but I didn't want to touch them. Oh, yeah? Oh, we'll we just keep our eye on this we'll guy. We call my brother. He's probably there. But I'm gonna call Yellowfellow first. I could go put another meter, a quarter in the meter. 
Yeah. I saw some photos on the street. I think I gave myself over an hour though, so I think I'm oh. okay. Alright, that's good. Yep. Oh, Mark. Mark yeah, Mark, I, got, Mark. I, I had this job interview at the mail place, but they told me that they do, like it's like where the government gets the mail, uh -huh. and they have secrets. Whoa. But it's not. Well, it's just like people. It's just like everybody's government mail. Yeah. They have secrets. It's not like necessarily secret secret. It's like private. Yeah. Available. But uh, is, it, the is it uh, am I divulging secrets by even saying they have that secrets. they are over there? Like there are secrets. Like, Yo, you can't say I that. Mean, is it a secret if it's private? Like I don't know what that is. I don't know what the difference. They, what they say? They said. Well, it's just like people's like. It's like people's like every government thing you're getting. Like if you own like a government like assistance, like welfare or medical oh. medicine, any of that kind of stuff. It's just like not. It's so you're not supposed to. Well, yeah, that's like uh, if you have perhaps. Uh, you know, doctor, a doctor, it's like, yeah, the fact that they have private information is not secret. It's like, obviously, you don't want to tell people what they're getting treated for or anything like that. But the fact that there is information out there in general is not secret. Yeah, okay, so, yeah. I think you're fine. I had a, um, extremely ty fast typing speed. Really? From Typing of the Dead. Oh, wow. Yeah, you recommended it to me, and it helped me today. I played a lot of Typing of the Dead. I like that it seems like the jobs so far, they have to woo you more than the other way around. I mean, yeah. I mean it's just like the market right now. I, uh, did you ask them questions and say, why should I work here, kind of? Oh, that's, that would have been a good idea. I, they always say, like, hey, do you have any questions? And then I uh, just say, no. Oh yeah. What am I? What am I supposed to say? What kind uh, of? He's like always oh, supposed to be asking questions. I guess I don't have any questions. It's like one of. I mean, is there anything? Yeah, I guess. Well, what do you eat for breakfast? Uh, that'd be a good one. Or it's <laughs> like, I mean, it, I bet you do have questions. Like actually. I mean. I don't have a lot of questions. I just no. I want to go day to day. I guess. Right? Maybe I have questions here. I only have inane questions. Yeah. <laughs> You ever use a fire extinguisher? <laughs> you ever had any crazy, has anybody ever gone postal? Oh uh, yeah. I guess you ne gotta know. It's not the post office, but it's pretty close. So yeah. Be. That might be an important one to figure out. Oh, I didn't record a message of the future with Mark. Yeah, I tried to say something, but then I gave up. You didn't try very hard. I said message of the future, and that's uh -huh. all I did. Uh -huh. Mark, walk down to the. Walk down to the. Oh, is this the message? Yeah, this is another message. I'm a little bit concerned that I ate all my pills like last night at, at 8 o'clock, and now I'm eating them again in the afternoon for 24 hours. You think it makes a difference? No, I don't. Right. I bet it was enough time.
I think you should be there. Unless he's out doing something else. Thank you. Wait, was that Andrew? I don't know. That wasn't me. It was a yellow fellow. Like um, that was weird. Uh, Andrew! Andrew, it's a phone. I don't know if I left the grandma's like bedroom door open. Uh, if it's closed, you can't hear it. There's like... So, yeah, I'm like living at grandma's house with Andrew. Yeah. But like, we're not like really going into grandma's bedroom. Uh-huh. Or her chair is still there. Uh, you know, like for like, the living room? Yeah. You had neither of you sit in it, huh? It's like the main chair. But we always had, I mean, we always had our own chairs. Like when we were hanging out with grandma, we had our own chairs. Like it just kind of falls up upon you. Like you just have your spot, you know? Like, like you sit over there, I'm sitting over here. It just, yeah. And everyone sits in the same one each time, basically. You just like start doing it. Did yeah. you have a family, like when you're at your, you were doing with your family? Yeah, my dad always sat in the chair with the arms. Nobody else got arms on their chair. Oh, yeah? Why? Yeah. Well, we should have got some new chairs. Well, no, it's like a matching set, but it's like the head of the table type thing, you know? Oh, he's like, like, did he get specifically to, to, to perhaps to be yeah. the, like, the... I arm. am the leader. I have the arms. Yeah. Even when you're eating, the arms are cumbersome, though. Could be. Could you be. You don't rest your arms on the on tape on the... Uh, yeah, let's put those elbows up on the table. What yeah. are you doing? But did you have a spot or just your father only? Yeah, I guess I sat I sat on the other end. So it's like the on the long ends of the table. Yeah. He sat and then my sister and my mom I guess my mom sat on the right hand side of my dad, so to my left. And then my sister sat so they're like, you know, we're on like the long ends. Yeah. And then my mom is on the, or we're at like, I guess, what do you, like, the short ends of the table, really. And then they're on the, like, the long ends of the table, I guess. I don't know. You see, like, we sit like, in the same place every time, though, yeah. Culturally, the head of the table, you're at the short end, it's like a power spot. Yeah, I think but it's, I think physically it's a worse spot. Yeah, you don't have as much space. Yeah. So, like, they're, like, and you're right about the arms. I mean, the arms would be getting in your way, I guess. It could be. It's like the price you pay for power. Yeah, like arms and no less table space. Um, I have no table space. I'm, I'm sitting right in front of a table and it's full of things. Maybe we should try to right there, right now. Yeah, yeah. I even like moved a whole thing that was on the table. Wow. That was like that stack of VCRs, and then now this time I come back and it's full of stuff again. Yeah. Hey, well, how does this happen to me? Hey, I don't know. Um, uh, I'm I'm trying to I'm trying to take all of the tapes from one type of box and put them in another box in the hopes that somehow by putting them into the new box we'll have more space in the end. I'm not sure why. I think we're going to move the couch a fraction of an inch or a fraction of something this direction towards the towards the studio. A fraction of a foot? A fraction of a foot. A fraction of a yard. Well, I mean, there's only like a, a foot and a half possible physical space right now. You know, we're going to move the, the, the foot and a half? I don't know. I guess so. I mean, that would give us a lot more room. But I guess the other thing is I'm supposed to start taking taking the bo those boxes behind behind the couch. Oh, behind the couch. Behind the booth, I guess. We can take them to our residences? Uh-huh. Right. Oh. We've talked about that. Yeah. I have room in my attic. Hey. I'm eating a uh, Wawa. That's the food. Um, really good. Um, I went to see that movie Pig yesterday. Oh yeah, you're going to the theaters? Um, I'm not going anymore. Now I'm judging again. And uh, I'm back to judging instead of going. Ah. Speaking yeah. of that, oh yeah. Speaking of judging? Yeah, uh, I, at work today, one of the last customers I had, no, the last customer I had was this lady who walked, somehow we missed her when she walked in and didn't tell her to put on a mask. And so she went to the bathroom first and then came back out from the bathroom zone, no mask. I'm like, who is this person? Why, who let them in here, kind of? But, yeah. And so then, and I saw in her hand one of those mesh masks. 
Oh. Like, does nothing. Yeah. And so then, funnily enough, it looked like she was meeting somebody on a date. Like, maybe, probably the first date, mm. I think. Um, and so then I sort of maybe soured the first date slightly because as soon as they made it up to the thing, I was like, can I get you a mask? And handed her a mask. Yeah. Like, I have a mask. I was like, that mask doesn't do anything. Yeah. And then she said the something about how it says on the box that the masks don't do anything to prevent COVID. And I was like, uh, what box are you talking about? Mm -hmm. She was talking about the medical mask, I guess. Mm. Um, but I didn't understand when she said that, and it wouldn't really matter anyway. It's a stupid yeah. thing to say. Anyway, so she looked like a fool. And then had to put on this other mask, and then I was like getting her order. She ordered something we didn't even have. I don't think the date went very well. I hope it didn't, kind of. But um, mask dates. Yeah, she she wearing a mesh mask. You're not gonna impress anybody. Also makes you look bad. I think. Like actually, you look less. Look at the ugly. at the job interview today, the guy gave me a salute. Really? So we were like, he's like, yeah, we're not uh, shaking hands. So I'm doing this. And I was like, huh. uh, okay, I did it too. <laughs> like, wow. Is that, uh, I, mean, I don't know if he was a military guy or something. I don't know what, what, why we're so... I feel like the bow is a little more... <laughs> the bow, maybe, maybe he would have bowed if I was uh, not Asian. <laughs> He's like, oh, oh. I'm like, oh, uh, hi. Wait, wait, no. <laughs> I forgot, yeah. <laughs> um, but uh, I guess I could tell, yeah. Then, then, um... At the end of the whole thing, though, he gave me a pat on the shoulder, and I was like, oh, a little bit. <laughs> like, don't touch me. Yeah. Like, I don't know about this. But he said, yeah, he said I did a, a good, it's like, ooh, a good good interview or something, so maybe I had a good, oh, wow. a good interview with the with the pat, but he, he couldn't resist the pat. I can't so help he didn't touch you. Yeah, we didn't do the handshakes already. He still did the pat, though. Uh, people love to touch other people. For yeah. Something. Like it's like doing deep in like humanity, I think. There must be something like, like what that. What about the, 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 the salute? We did the salute. I don't know about the salute, yeah. Well, I mean, it's, it's better than... I'm, Touching. I'm fine with the touch, with the, 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 the salute, the better than the, the hand, the, the, the shoulder tap. But I, when I was leaving, I did a little salute again. <laughs> and it was a little weird. I was like, oh, I guess I was saluting. But I guess I just did the salute, and it looks like Hitler to me. Like, oh, oh, but maybe you don't, when you salute, you don't do too far. Yeah, you're going too far. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I don't know. You're supposed to go down, otherwise you're doing Hitler. Like, oh my God, yeah, you like ruined the interview at the end by, <laughs> by <laughs> the, the, the Hitler. Yeah. So, oh, whoa, wrong salute. No. Are you a Nazi? <laughs> oh, I just don't use the salute. <laughs> <laughs> what, aren't you? <laughs> Are you not? <laughs> yeah. Oh, I found a box of, uh, these are episodes. Whoa. What is it? Which, what, from when? Uh, July and June and May. Oh, and that's June like a July. recent one? Yep. That's like very new. Yeah. They're, those were from the house because I was taking those back to the house to capture and then yeah. bring them back. Yeah. Interesting. All right, here's a message of the future. Oh, nice. Hey, future test the past. Talking about job interviews. Talk to Mark about being a good person and playing acoustic guitar at the pool. I had pad thai from, and uh, Thai truck is closed on Tuesday. Right, I got this couch. Do I keep the couch future? Do you still have this couch, or did I put it back where I found it because it's gross to get a couch in an alleyway? Are you, have you gone postal? by future. I almost, I, I had a very t fast typing speed. Uh-huh. All right, I didn't, I almost told him I wrote a book. He's like, wow, you have a very fast typing speed. So yeah, I, I wrote a book. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, that's, it's true. But yeah. You could buy that book. Viewers on uh, YDHWM.com, just click on the thing that says store. I, I did the typing t test so fast that he was on his phone. And then I was like, I'm done. He's like, what? Oh. Oh. Yeah, wow, he wasn't expecting it to be that he wasn't fast. Wasn't expecting huh? me to be that fast at the typing test. 
That's weird. I guess everyone's like typing is a lo losing is like slowly a lost art, perhaps. Yeah. Oh, everyone's oh, swiping and stuff. Oh, mm -hmm. here's more. Here's more c episode tapes. Wow. Uh, put those in this too? No. Maybe. Maybe un. Uh, what kind of box system do we use for episodes? Always. Oh fuck. <laughs> I thought that, that maybe some of the purpose of moving the the uh, the tape over tape into the that size box was to free up the other boxes for episode tape. Yes, Canical that is true. But butlers. you still have to convert the boxes to be like thirty to hold thirty two episodes or thirty two tapes, you know? Yeah. Which is a process in and of itself. So. Uh oh. Uh oh. It is true. Yeah. Uh oh. Is VCR struggling? Good thing we have some extras. Well, and I'm gonna try it again, I guess, even though it's like insanity. Come on, oh there. Oh, you have like mechanical butlers. Oh, maybe yeah, that's you what I was thinking about butlers. Yeah, you said like something about butlers. Really yesterday, I was talking about butlers a lot. Yeah. Tin foil hats that do help you instead of just crazy people. And I was like, I thought, I thought that I had brought up butlers out of nowhere, but maybe it was because of this reminded me of. The concept of butlers in general. Ass. I was talking about butlers with him. Hi. Oh, yeah, you were here. What do you have to say to the future? Were you? No, you weren't. No, I wasn't. Fred, you're doing a good job. It's okay. Just relax. Keep on, keep on eating. Great them. <laughs> That's Fred. Bye, future. Fred, keep on eating. Great them, Fred. That's what Fred's advice is. We made it. Wow, another episode. Hey, look at me. Down the drain. Look, I'm getting a job. Look at you, looking sharp today. I want to say, oh, me and my brother are uh, on the way to get this job interview because my brother gave me a ride somewhere. And then we were saying like things that you shouldn't say in a job interview. Like, like give me the job. Come on, dummy. Like, that was like our little joke. And then the guy asked me, he's like, did you practice? <laughs> did you take me an interview? And I said, no, because <laughs> otherwise like I said, kind of not in a good way. All right, here's the thing. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for watching. It's Tuesday. We're on TCTV, channel 22, 1130, and 2 a.m. Check it out. Yeah, why do you keep them on YouTube? 360-3634, calling message on TV, yeah! Whitingshiproom.com, check it out! Spill Horizon is a good song, thank you. TCTV, the baby, Dory Fett, let's go to the first five video. Mark the top player, stop by Tom, Thurston County. Washington State, USA, thank you, and viewers, it's you, watching, thank you. Hey John, call me! Hell yeah, dog! Bye-bye. Bye! -bye. Bye.